What's going on guys? Jiffy Pop TV here again with you with some Clash Royale videos, some Clash Royale gameplay. You know the works. So today we're going to do a couple different things. We're going to start off with a, a replay that I actually just played, which was fantastic. After we do that, uh, we're going to do a grand battle challenge. See if I can uh, continue. I have uh, four wins, two losses, I believe. So I'm going to play a match of that, see if I can get another win. If not, then, you know, we'll kind of just go from there. So let's let's get this started right away with, um, oh, I guess I should, before I show you the video, this was the deck I was using, uh, a Royal Giant Beatdown Goblin Gang, you know, got the new gang card, Beatdown, kind of goes together. I and I blah blah blah. So um, the mirror card though is actually working pretty decently. I just got my zap up to level eleven, so that's been that's been working wonders against the uh, the people I've been facing. So let's get into this uh, this this replay here. Oops, I don't want to share it. I want to watch it. All right, so we're going against a gung moonlight. So right from the beginning, I got a decent starting hand. He's also got a pretty good starting hand. Um, I, from the beginning, was going to play an Executioner. He also plays his Executioner. So, at this point, his is one level higher than mine. At this point, of course, I don't see up there that he has a P.E.K.K.A. and Elite Barbs. I don't know this at this point. But, so far I go into it, I'm like, alright, I'll play my Musketeer for backup. I'll play another Musketeer for backup. And now I'm like, oh, cool, I'm going in with some pretty good armor. Here comes the P.E.K.K.A. P.E.K.K.A.'s going to do work. I'm slowly but surely with the Electro Wiz and my Musketeer going to take it out. Those two minions will still live. Uh, at this point, I was hovering over Zap, but I thought against using Zap, so I just let the I just took the minion damage. So at this point, I kind of reset. Was like, all right, let me let me save up for my Royal Giant. I'm going to save up for my Royal Giant real quick. We're going to get in some work, do what we can, and then he plays Goblins and Elite Barbs, and I'm like, oh crap, this dude has Pekka and Elite Barbs. So I play Goblin Gang out the back. I play uh, a log to kind of slow him down, and then I play an executioner in a weird spot. So there you go. Minute 20 seconds in, I've taken crap ton of damage. This dude's taken none. I'm going into this like I got to do something. So he's going to play the executioner sideways. I'm not going to get any tower damage. His executioner and that tower are going to destroy me. And then here comes another P.E.K.K.A. So the P.E.K.K.A. comes down. I drop a musketeer in the back. I'm going to drop a Electro Wiz right aside over here to hopefully take that executioner out I drill the, I throw the goblin gang actually later than I wanted to I wanted that executioner to fall and then throw the goblin gang but that defense worked out he also had minions in there which fell pretty quick so that defense was actually working out pretty good so now now we go into uh, I haven't used my royal giant yet you know I haven't been able to touch his tower it's a minute left you know you start to lose hope I'm, I'm not really sure what's gonna go and then he plays a tombstone and I'm like okay so if I play my royal giant you know i'm gonna have to deal with that tombstone before i do anything so i play the executioner i'm doing work against these tombstone he plays the goblin gang out the back which is actually dumb i i mirrored my executioner so now i got two he throws the cry face because he knows his goblin gang and all those tombstones are going dead so now i got my royal giant in the front he plays that giant i get the electro wizard out so now we got royal giant electro wizard log two executioners i drop down um a zap, I believe it was. My executioner's gonna work. So why not? I'll throw a third ex executioner. So we got three executioners going down the lane. Here comes another mirror. How about four executioners, boys and girls? Yeah, let's do it. We got four coming in. He's placing troops faster than he can say it, but it doesn't matter because those troops are all gonna die. One executioner goes down, but we still got three. Two doing work on the tower. Boom. One doing work on that other executioner. I throw the Royal Giant down just in case to take the game, uh, just to make sure I get that game out. But all in all, I had uh, the coolest part about that is I had four executioners down. Two of them were doing work on the tower. Uh, no, three of them were doing work on the tower. One of them died, and then I had one in the back of the other two doing work, taking out that other executioner. And it just four of them were just wrecking havoc. I've never had that many on screen at once, so that was that was pretty epic. Um, so that's that. That was that was fantastic. As you can see, that that O to three defeat. That dude. Uh, that's actually a person in my clan. Yeah, he he wrecked me pretty bad. We're not gonna show you that video. He he wants to be famous though. I'll I'll throw that out there. So when he watches it, he'll 
he'll go wild. So here we go. Like I said, four wins, two losses. We're going to use the same deck I was using before. Maybe we can try to get four executioners out at once again because that was ridiculous. Going against a Noel. Wingy face. It's actually a pretty good starting hand. So I'm going to start with the executioner. We're actually going to go left. Most people go right when they play this game. Everybody kind of just goes right. I'm going to go left with this. I'm actually going to let that go. I'm going to drop. I'm going to let. I'm going to save up, save up. I'm going to drop a royal giant. And a Musketeer. Royal Giant will do work there. Executioner and Musketeer will take out this Giant. While that dude will do work on the um, on the tower. Ooh, he has a Lightning. That's actually, that's fairly interesting. Executioner will actually do work to take out those minions. I will use the Electro Wizard and take zero damage. We're going to drop a quick Goblin Gang. See if I can't get that Goblin. Ooh, okay. Alright, I didn't actually need that log, so that was a wasted log. Get a little extra damage. Those spear goblins are going to throw in some work. Goblin gang getting it done once again. So we go into this. 1,200 damage in the lead. Actually, I guess that's 1,100. We got 1,100 tower lead right now. I'm going to let my elixir save up. He's going to play executioner out the back. I'm going to save up to about max here. I'm going to play mine out the back. Get ready with Musketeer. Actually, oh, he's going to play. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to I'm gonna mirror that. So we have two Executioners going down here. I'm going to have to, uh, I'm at the Zap. Because, man, this is bad. That tower is going to fall. I'm not 100% sure why he threw the well played. I'm not sure if he's trying to troll me or not. So that went from looking good to my favor to like, man, we're going to, we're taking we're taking a beat down here. All right, so Electro Wizard's gonna go down. He throw minions over there. I'm not worried about those. I wish this is where I wish I had my log. I'm gonna try and drop my log. Log's gonna fail because now we're gonna have that tombstone. I'm not even gonna get one touch on the tower. Um, I'm not 100% worried about that. All right, so I'm gonna throw this musketeer up here for the kicks and giggles. See if I can't get, nope, I'm not going to get any tower. I was trying to get some tower touches there. That's not going to work. So here we go. We'll drop an Executioner. We got to play some defense. This is where we'll drop the Goblin Gang out the back. He'll play a Lightning. I got to drop an Electro Wizard. He's going to play Arrows. I need to get a tower here. Nah, now I'm going to get two towers. So that's a loss. So there goes my, there goes my, um, um, man, I can't think. I really can't think. There goes my there goes my grand challenge with a loss. I'll throw a good game to the guy. He's not taking the three crown though. I'm not giving that up. So Well, it was a great start. Um I don't exactly know what happened. I'm gonna um I'm gonna do what my good old buddy Chief Pat says. Uh, my buddy Chief Pat, who's not my buddy, he always says if uh you know if you get a loss like that must be disconnection issues. I, I must have I must have dis disconnected somewhere through that battle. So that's all right. Let's open this up. See what we get. We get four thousand gold, three tombstones, some more goblin gangs, which are in like every chest opening. Uh, all in all, nah, nothing great. So that was that. Well, I got no chests. Let's um, let's go into uh. I guess we'll do one more. We'll do one more battle against Hayden. This is a regular battle now. Hopefully I could get a win here so that I could get my, uh, give me a chest so I could open a chest here because my chest slots were empty. We'll play an Executioner out the back. He's going to play a Golem. So, poof. That's rough. All right, I'm going to play a second Executioner here. Then I'll start saving up some, um... Okay, he's going to play a Valk, which is actually going to do ridiculous work. Okay, that did nothing. Of course, he'll have an Ice Wizard out the back. We're going to have to play this Goblin Gang over here. Hopefully take that Ice Wizard out, which we will do. He'll zap, so now i got to play the Musketeer out the back here to distract those Archers, which even the Archers are going to take out. Wow. So even the archers are going to get taken out by my, by that, or my musketeer is going to get taken out by that chair. All right, we'll drop a, 
We'll drop a Royal Giant in the front here. We'll get my Zap ready. Zap, Zap, Zap. I guess I didn't have to Zap since I got Electro Wizard. Of course, he'll play a Valkyrie. So I'll get maybe two hits off the tower. One, two. I'm going to have to do something against this Valkyrie. So I'll drop my Electro Wizard. And of course, I'm not going to be able to do anything. So now I'm just going to take useless damage. All right. Well, 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 this is, this is, this is another, here we go. This is another awful game. Not in my favor here. Executioner, of course, here comes the, uh, here comes the golem. Um, all right. Uh, I'll drop another executioner right behind. We'll just start loading up troops. We'll play a musketeer. We'll throw a log, which is not necessary. He'll come out with a... Um, he's going to come out with a graveyard. So I'm going to have to drop a... Um, wow, okay. That's not going to work. We'll throw down a zappy. Alright, this is where we're going to go in with a royal giant. He's going to play that inferno tower. So we're going to get ready with a musketeer. And gang... All right, we're gonna th we're gonna drop another musketeer. We'll drop a log. He's gonna play some truce, but he's got nothing. We'll drop another executioner. Oh, and that's a tower drop. Tower drop. Ten seconds left. I'm guessing he's gonna play something. He's left the match. I don't think we'll have enough time. I put that royal giant in the wrong place, but wow. So I was just saying, I was just saying in that match. We had two matches that I showed you the one match in the beginning, and then I showed you this match, and I got, I mean, I golden chest is all right. I, I can do that while I, while I go to sleep tonight. Um, But I just showed you a match. I got me in the legends. That's awesome. I just showed you a match before where I was losing straight through till, till the end, and then came back for executioners, killed it. I was losing that game straight through till the end. One final push. I had... Uh, Royal Giant, two Royal Giants, two Executioners, one Electra Wiz, two Musketeers down. Which which I, I always say, guys, you watch my videos, you've seen tons of videos like this, and it always comes back to my motto. Never, ever give up in battle. Always clash on, because you never know. You can start off real bad, but it's not how you start, it's how you finish. And just like that, that's going to wrap up our video for today. Uh, if you got anything, any comments, questions, concerns, anything, leave them, leave some comments for me. Uh, any decks you want me to try out, any challenges you want me to do, anything, leave them in the comments for me. Like, don't forget to like the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I had a blast. It's nice talking to you guys. Hope you have a great rest of your day, rest of your weekend, and I'll, uh, I'll see you guys at the next video. Peace out.